We turn now to the crime surge in America, making its way to Congressman and New York GOP gubernatorial candidate Lee Zeldin's front door. Two people were shot on his porch Sunday afternoon with stray bullets landing just feet from his twin daughters. Our correspondent Christina Thompson is live in our New York newsroom with more. Christina. It's very scary, but the shooting happened in broad daylight just after 2 p.m. on Sunday, which is a trend we're seeing emerge from cri this crime surge around the country. Criminals empowered to perform heinous crimes in the middle of the day. Zeldin's 16-year-old daughters were studying in their kitchen at around 2.20 when they heard the gunshots and screams. They were incredibly quick thinking, running upstairs to lock themselves in a bathroom and call 911. For that, Zeldin says he's very thankful. It hits really close to home when it shows up on your front doorstep. I'm just so grateful that my daughters responded uh, as quickly, as swiftly as they did. One stray bullet was found just 30 feet from where his daughters were sitting. Now, the victims, they were two teenagers. They were shot just below Zeldin's front porch. Police found them hurt and in the bushes. They were taken to the hospital, and they are expected to survive. Zeldin says that he doesn't know who the teens are, but in the story of an underdog candidate campaigning on unrelenting violent crime in his area, this shooting highlights exactly why Zeldin is focusing so much of his campaign on crime. He's promised to tighten the state's loose bail laws and crack down on criminals, especially repeat offenders. Katrina, Bob. Yeah, Christina, thanks. And of course, remembering right. uh, Zeldin was also uh, attacked a few months back.